In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to easily edit your videos in the iMovie app. Right now I'm sitting in my office because I've got big windows that give me great natural light. I'm using my $15 Joby tripod that I got from Amazon. I'm using my $20 Movo mic plugged into my iPhone. And because the phone wasn't quite level, I'm using my storage bin to get it to be eye level with me. So I'm going to take all of those tips that I've shown you in the last few weeks and show you how to edit this video on iMovie. So iMovie is a free editing app that you can use on your iPhone. So let's go over the setup that I have for this video today. Okay, so this is my setup. I've got my chair. I've got my big windows that are giving me great natural light. I've got the Joby tripod, which was $15. I've got the storage bin that I showed you guys. There's the adapter for the mic, which is $10. And here is the mobile mic that I had clipped onto my blouse that I bought for $20. And of course I was using my phone to record, which I'm using to record this section. And that's it. Okay, so we're gonna use iMovie to edit our video. We're gonna tap on iMovie, tap Create Project, and tap on Movie. So I'm gonna select my clips in the order that I want them in. They're, it's not necessarily in the order that I shot them in, but if you want them to be in a certain order, that's how you should select them. Okay, and then tap Create Movie. So here's my timeline, and this is the order I selected my clips in because that's the order I want them in. Okay, so to edit a clip or to trim it or to add text to it, you're gonna tap on it to select it. And you'll know you selected it because you'll have this yellow border around the clip. So you'll see on the left-hand side, you've got scissors, which means that's how you trim a clip. A clock is how you speed up or slow down a clip if you want to add some kind of slow-mo effect. The microphone is for audio, the T is for text, and the diagram is for filters. So you can do black and white or change the filter or the color temperature of your clip. On the right hand side we have detach, I'm sorry, we have split, which just means if you want to cut a video in half or into pieces. Detach means you can take out the audio and detach it from the video. So this, for instance, is if you shot a video outside and you don't want that outside windy noise, you can take that out and put some music under that clip instead. Duplicate is to duplicate the clip and delete is to obviously delete it. So for here, we're just going to trim these clips and we're going to add some text to them. So we're just doing a basic, simple editing video. So let's see if this is the clip I want at the beginning. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to... So yes, this is my intro clip. Obviously, I wanna cut out the beginning where I'm fixing my hair and I'm not looking at the camera. Um, so let's go ahead and select that clip. And we're gonna tap at the beginning of the clip when it's highlighted to trim it. So we're gonna bring it forward like this. We're gonna go past the part where I grab my hair. I'm still not looking at the lens until right about there and there I'm smiling. So right before I start speaking, we'll stop. Let's see if that worked. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to easily edit your videos in the iMovie app. Right now. So we also wanna take out that ending part where I'm reaching out to press stop the record button. So again, we select the clip and we're gonna drag the end forward to where I stop speaking and I just smile. Right there. Let's see if that works. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to easily edit your videos in the iMovie app. Right now I'm sitting in my office. That's great. Okay, so this next clip was transitioned into by this middle transition you see here, those little diamonds. And that's what they are, is basically a transition. It transitions from one clip to the other. And you get to choose different options on what you want that transition to look like. I have it on dissolve. You can choose slide, and let's see what that would look like. Easily edit your videos in the iMovie app. Right now I'm sitting in my office because 
So that's what slide would look like. So this clip, let's make sure it's the right one. Okay, that all looks good. Let's see what the ending looks like. All right, so let's change that transition to slide. Let's maybe change the seconds to 0.5 seconds and see what that looks like. So iMovie is a free editing app that you can use on your iPhone. So let's go over again all the equipment that I've shown. That's a better transition, so we're gonna keep that one. So let's see if this clip was trimmed properly. All right, so I did two takes of that. So again, I wanna select it and trim it. Make sure you have it on the scissors. I've selected the clip, so I wanna bring it forward. That was my first take and I redid it. I started right there. And then at the end, I wanna take out the part where I'm reaching out to press the record button. We'll stop there. Okay. Now let's change this transition also to slide. And let's change it to 0.5 seconds and see what that looks like. iMovie. So iMovie is a free editing app that you can use on your iPhone. So let's go over the setup that I have for this video today. So maybe let's trim that beginning part just a little bit till there. All right, so it goes right into my next clip where I'm showing you the setup. And let's see this transition here. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed. So I wanna trim out that beginning part where I'm not looking at the lens. Again, you tap on the clip to select it. Make sure you're on the scissors and you're gonna trim forward until I start speaking. And let's go ahead and change that transition again to slide so that all the transitions match. Let's do 0.5 seconds and see what that looks like. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Let's make that a little tighter. Right there. There we go. Now let's see how the ending looks. About video production. All right, so we wanna edit that part out where I reach in and end it with the smile. Okay, so now I'm gonna to wanna to add some text. At the beginning, I don't really introduce myself, so I want to add my title, and I would do that here. You select that clip, and instead of the scissors, you're going to select the T. And iMovie has tons of options for different texts that can come in or come out or um, fade in and out. They'll pop up, you know, different options that you'll have. So I'm just going to choose Reveal right here. And the text will show up in the middle, and you'll just tap on the text so that you can change it. So let's type in my name the same way that you would type regularly, nothing special. Put in my title, director of video services for HAR. Make sure that's spelled correctly, done. Now, I don't want it to be in the center right on my face, so iMovie gives you the option to bring that title down to the bottom where it says lower, so we would tap lower. So we're done with that. Let's go back to our movie, see how that looks. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to easily edit your- Great, so it popped in right there. Now, at the end of the video, I wanna give you a call to action. So you might wanna put a phone number here, a website, whatever you choose. I'm gonna choose my YouTube channel and we're gonna do it the same way. 
we want you to go to youtube.com slash h-a-r-t-v to check out some more tutorial videos. Done? I want that to be lower. So we'll put that down there. Let's see how that looks. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Keep an eye out in the coming weeks for So it pops up just like that. I think I want to add some music. So let's go ahead to this bolt right here on the right hand side. And this is your project settings. So we're gonna go there. And as you can see, you can change the project filter. You can make it black and white, just leave it as none. But iMovie gives you some options down here for theme. And also some more effects that you can add to the video. So if you wanna start the, vid the video on black and it'll fade in from black, we can press that one. Fade out to black, we would press that one. And let's add a theme soundtrack. So maybe let's choose playful and see what that soundtrack sounds like. We'll press done and let's test it out. So iMovie does a really good job at figuring out the audio level that you have in your video and then placing the music at a volume where it will blend really well with your video. So if you tap on it, you'll see that it says foreground. So that's because the music is in the background right now. But if you want it in the foreground or you want it to be louder, you would tap on that, play, and it will be much louder than it was before. In this video tutorial, I'm gonna show you how to easily edit your videos in the iMovie app. All right, so that's a little too loud for me. We're gonna go back to background. So the music is there, it's just played in the background. And as you can see, when I chose in the project settings a theme and different settings, it's got that little fade, fade in button right there. And that means it's starting with black and it fades into my video. There are my transitions. There's my other transition, my other transition, my other clip and my last transition and my last text. And then when the video ends, it will fade to black and the music will fade out. Below, if there's anything else you'd like to learn about video production. And that's it. You'll click done and there's your movie. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Keep an eye out in the coming weeks for more tutorials on how to produce videos at home. And leave a comment below if there's anything else you'd like to learn about video production.